Hey everyone, Flying Dutchie here and welcome back to the Netherlands in EU4 Domination, the Dutch development stacking modifier run, where we are applying semi-tall. We are going to try to take all of this as a North Sea Empire and we are trying to conquer all the rest of uh, America, maybe almost everything here and I want to take all of this here as well. So let's see how that will go. Uh, we are coring a lot of things. We are over 100%, unfortunately. But that will go away soon. Uh, we are trying to un-siege all of these things over here. Get a couple of, uh, of cannons to the army. We have another colonist available, so let's see where we're going to send that one. I guess we're going to take this uh, line over here. I'm sorry if you hear, if you hear some, uh, some children screaming on the background, because uh, they are screaming outside. So, can't help that of course. Take care of that one. We are building three cannons so that we have a 50 army. We also have a 50 army over here, and they are going towards... Australia, I think. Let's get this going. Done. We have our new batch of sailors. We are almost out of sailors again. It will it will just stay a problem if you are using so much sailors. But oh well. Okay. To get and take care of that one. Are you going there or not? I don't see you moving. Yes, they are. Rebels in Cornwall. I cannot get there. Well, I can with my new ships over here. Yes, I will send this army over. Maybe we can get there in time before they siege down the province. Yes, we can. Good. Done. And come back on the ship and go back over there. Okay, what is this war? Oh, did we already win? Oh, that looks good actually. Where is this guy? Yeah, I guess I cannot piece you out, right? Which colonial nation is that? It's Louisiana. Can I give this to Mexico and give this... No, we cannot piece that one out. Well, we can if I uh, piece out these ones separately, but the Wargol guy is the Hasina, so that's going to be a problem, right? We can do this one. But you don't accept yet, okay? I don't know why, because I have sieged down everything. Or can I piece out everything with this? No, we can't, so I want to separate piece the people out, I can separate piece. Pouring everything we can. Some more cannons coming up. Are you kidding me? Well, I cannot go back now. We are going to lose this whole army, aren't we? Why? We lost the whole army. We lost the whole fucking army. The trip from here to here is not you cannot make that one and the AI is not going through your your provinces where you have supply. So don't come with reactions that you did that wrong because I will ban you from the channel. 100% sure that that is going to happen if you do that. Fucking hell, man. I don't want to play anymore.
That is so stupid. Why can they not make that trip? <laughs> Doesn't make any sense. Did we lost all our marines? Yeah, and I can't make more marines, so... <sighs> I, I just can't care anymore, guys. I can't care anymore. I just can't care anymore about everything. Why am I able to take this but not the other one? The game is so confusing. Oh, you can't take care of that with no morale. Yeah, now you're gonna run back. Oh, I think I'm gonna end, end, uh, end the series, unfortunately. It's no more fun. It's just rebel stamping and I'm just uh, completely burned down on EU4. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop the video. This will be the last part. We will not go further with our spreadsheet. Uh, just imagine if we had everything. Um, I can't take care of it anymore. I can't. This is no, no, no longer a game. It is just uh, uh, annoyance. It is running your rebels. And we are winning the game already. There is no, no challenge anymore. And if there's a challenge, I need to fight with 300 armies versus 300 armies, and I don't want to do that anymore. So I will, I will just stop uh, this series. It's better for my health, really. And there will be no EU4 run for a while anymore, because uh, I am completely burned out on it. I think there will be a new EU4 run when there is a patch coming out, which is over a couple of months. So yeah, sorry about that, guys, but this, this is just... Uh, this is not good for me anymore. I will I will stop playing this. And uh, hopefully you are going to join the next uh, the next uh, videos of other games. Because Victoria 3 is also a flop. It's horrible. With the new patch that is uh, $15 which only adds a couple of flavors and the game did not even change. So Paradox needs to do a better job with uh, with their games if they want to uh, keep me playing them. And let's see what, what will be the new uh, new game on the channel. I don't know yet. Because uh, mostly it's all Paradox. So if you have any suggestions then uh, let me know. And I will end the video here. Thanks for watching guys and bye-bye. Uh,